everybody, this is Joyrider TV correspondent Lou Westerfeld checking in from Surfside, Kailua, Hawaii. You're watching Show Us Your Cat on Joyrider TV. Aloha! It's Joe here for Joyrider TV and we're going to get straight in on our next episode of Show Us Your Cat. So we're starting off by heading over to Kentucky in the USA where Danny has got his 1989 Hobie 18, which is called Betty. Here we go. <laughs> In Cave Run Lake, and you can see there he's sporting some of the old school Epo rudders. Very nice indeed. If you can find the old Epo rudders, then you are winning. All right. And Danny, he's a good traveler with his boat, doesn't mind towing it for a couple of hours. Here he is on Siesta Key in Florida. Very nice. Whoa! Holy lowly! So next we're heading down to the Cayman Islands in the, the Caribbean where Calum has got a 2016 Hobie 16. A few bits of advice here for Calum. The first one is uh, if you ease the travelers out, you can sail with a bit more tension in the, in the sheets. And it's always, always a good idea to keep a hand on the main sheet, always. Otherwise it could end up in a pitch pole situation and to avoid the pitch pole here you could also move back a bit on the boat quite far forwards for this reaching point of sail But that is an absolute fantastic pitch pole. I think we'd give that seven out of 10, uh, about 100% for effort. Next, we're heading back to the USA where we've got Richard's boat based on the Columbia River. It's a 1975 Hobie 16. And I think you can only agree that for a boat that's 44 years old, this is in fantastic condition. And uh, you're not gonna believe it, but if you're in the area, or if, 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 if you're not in the area, this boat is for sale for just two and a half thousand dollars. You could have yourself a pristine piece of Hobie 16 history to go sailing on. And that is a lovely looking 18 in the background there. Next, we're gonna head to the Middle East, to Dubai, where Mohammed has got a 2003 Nacra F18. This is actually the second of NACRA's F-18 designs, the first one being the Inter-18, of course. Now, Mohammed and his NACRA has been up against it through the years. Pretty much everything on his boat has broken at some point. He's broken the main sheet, the rudders, the mainsail, the spinnaker, the trampoline. He's cracked his rear beam and she lives like a sieve. So I think Mohammed does get the gold star for putting up with a broken boat but still getting out there and giving it the beans and finally we're heading down under to australia to safety beach victoria in australia where jeff has got his foiling a class now i recognize this boat i think this used to belong to one of the best catamaran sailors in the world glenn ashby uh, so jeff must have bought it off glenn but this is a great looking foiling A-class. Very, very fast. And what a shot. Jeff has clearly got his foiling A-class sailing nailed. So another gold star there to Jeff on the foiling A-class. Looks good. Very nice. So thanks for watching. And thanks again for sending in your boat. At the start of this episode, that was Will from Hawaii, who was actually the guy who who uh, sparked the idea of doing the show as your cat videos. 
I'm embarrassed to say, a bit of a tribute video uh, to Joyrider TV. If you want to see that video, just head down to the description below. Otherwise, keep those videos and photos coming in. If you can, just email them to me straight. The email address again is in the description below. But thanks for watching. Thanks for showing us your cat. And uh, we'll see you next Sunday for some more. Show us your cats.